Once you do start diving, you're hooked. Well, I was uh, very active in athletics from high school through college. I rode crew in college, which is a big push on your ankles because your feet are tied down and you push a big oar. And it just over decades of riding on a boat every day in rocking weather, it just got sore and sore and, and it built up bone spurs to the point I had to look like an orange on the side of outside of my right ankle. And it got to where I was walking to limping for a couple, three years, and I just needed to get it fixed. It was either st stop running boats and doing what I want to do or get my ankle fixed. And so I got it fixed. Well, first of all, he, he has, uh, he's very charismatic. Uh, he has a tremendous charisma. Uh, I have a lot of respect for what he's done with his life. And he was having trouble with, you know, essentially severe ankle pain and arthritis. Um, so a lot of the wear and tear let's say that he had experienced throughout dives and being on boats all these years, right, had led to a tremendous amount of loss of cartilage of his ankle joint uh, to the point where somebody, I would say, that is very stoic and can tolerate a lot of pain was, it was starting to affect the, the very essence, I think, of, of where he likes to be, which is below sea level, let's say. <laughs> Well, in any, any repair or any uh, uh, hospital or surgery, I worry about the down time. But uh, I was assured that I'd be out maybe two to four months, which sound like forever, but I had to get it done. I got tired of limping and I uh, heard about, about Dr. San Giovanni and from my orthopedic surgeon here in Key Largo, and I contacted him and he said, we can do it. Uh, with Captain Slate, is we're talking about a very active individual, and um, that part of that activity, like I said, in, involves uh, motion and mobility of his ankle joint. And although there were options, I felt that doing a total uh, ankle joint replacement, what's called a total ankle arthroplasty, was was going to be the best option for him in terms of keeping the mobility and addressing the the pain that he was having. So what we're doing is we're actually replacing the surfaces that actually meet. So it's not replacing the whole bone, right? So we're replacing just the, the joint surfaces. So very similar to a knee replacement, um, you have something where it's metal and then a plastic metal. So the tibia and the talus, which are the main surfaces uh, where the cartilage used to be, these are where we actually make our cuts. And these cuts, once again, are, are based on his CAT scan. And, and also it gives us a, a model let's say, of where, how we're supposed to make these cuts. Captain Slate is doing great. I mean, he came in uh, now, I think, over the two-year mark. Uh, his x-rays are looking great. He's, his mobility has been maintained. He's back doing the things that he loves to do. I think he's quite ecstatic to the point where he told me uh, that he doesn't even really remember that which ankle was the one that we operate on, and he's doing so well. Dr. San Giovanni, thanks for repairing my right ankle. And I, call, I wrote him a little note on one of my uh, pictures, thank you for repairing my right flipper. <laughs>